Hey guys, what's going on? It is Greg, and uh, today we are talking disc golf. So I know not everyone on this channel come, came for disc golf, um, but disc golf's becoming a pretty big part of my life. And so uh, I'm going to be talking about it on here, and today we're talking bags. Now, in the summer, I roll around with a Zuka cart a lot of times, um, especially for practice rounds, just the ability to have a lot more discs and a lot more, a lot more duplicates of molds just really helps me get practice shots. So I can throw the same shot with the same mold multiple times um, to figure out what shot is going to work best for me. And so uh, I find having a cart in the summer awesome. Uh, in the winter, I've been using this. It's my grip. BX4, I think. I don't remember all their naming systems. Um, these are great bags. I actually don't really have any complaints with it. I have plenty of storage um, as far as like other stuff goes. I do find I don't quite have the storage for as many discs as I've gotten used to pulling my Zuka cart. And so for that reason, I've been kind of just exploring what else is out there, um, exploring my other options. Um, and I came across uh, this it's still in the box. I like their little logo. I don't know if it's going to zoom in on that or not. Um, the, the Squatch bag and I think these guys are fairly new. Um, I'm already shocked by like how light this is. Uh, it's like in the box and it feels extremely light and it should hold quite a bit uh, Quite a few more discs than my current grip bag. So we're gonna open this up and check it out together mm. Sorry if that box was loud All right, here we go This is the squash bag got the it said salmon, but this is a little more orange than salmon, I would say. And it's supposed to be like charcoal looking, I think. So, um, yeah. I don't know where to start. So it's got these big side pockets. That I guess you can use to like store a, store a jacket or something in there. And then it has these littler side pockets that you can store like bottles in i think even discs will fit in there if you need to carry some extra discs um there's one of those on each side um nice little tag here Ooh, you gotta love when there's magnets i assume this is like the phone pocket yeah so you can take your i got my phone here Drop it right in there. Oh, magnety goodness. So that's perfect. And another one of these big side pockets where you can store a bunch of stuff. Um, it's got the top putter pocket up here. So you can, uh, oh look, a little sticker's up in here for me. That's nice. Um, so I assume this pushes down and then they say like up to six putters up in here. There's like another little section. You probably can't see very well because it's black, but, um, but yeah. I have to play around, figure out how that works. There's like, whoa. Another really, really deep pocket, but I'm not sure what that's for. Interesting. Kind of just experiencing this for the first time. So there's a front pocket, and this is pushed in. I think you can put, um, you can actually put a disc or two in here. And let's open this main compartment here. And here is the main compartment. Um, this is a, like a little insulated cooler that goes in one of these side pockets. So you can keep some drinks cool, I think. Let's see. Yeah, so you can see it's it's insulated. Um, definitely don't need this in the winter, but you can keep some drinks cool. Uh, if that's your thing, if that's what you want. Um, that's not a big selling point to me, but I know some people it would be. And then you have the main compartment here. And this pushes back. I think there's, yeah, there's Velcro in there. There you go. 
nice big storage. So uh, that's a Squatch bag. Uh, I'm gonna pause the video because I don't think you guys want to see me putting everything in here. Uh, it'll take a minute for me to organize and figure out how I want it. But uh, I'm gonna pause the video and then once I get this full, um, I'll come back and uh, give some final thoughts. Cut all the discs over into the Squatch bag and as you can tell, uh, I can, there's still plenty of room. I even added two additional discs than what was in my um, my grip bag. And my grip bag was over full. Like I had one disc too many in there than it should really be to make it comfortable to use. I could probably do at least two more discs in this front pocket. I've got the, the top, I got six putters in the top. And then I have these sides, I could probably fit know four or five on each side here and then you have these big pockets there's there's just so much more room in here and the crazy thing is is it's so much lighter like I put this on and it's just the discs like it's the lightest backpack I've ever used um, it's the lightest discs golf bag I've ever picked up got, got room here for more um, so I'm actually way, way, way more impressed with this than I even thought it was gonna be. Um, I can load this thing up, put tons and tons of discs in here, and uh, and and I'm carrying. I'm only paying the price of carrying the plastic, not the weight of the bag. So I picked this up, and honestly, this completely full is just a little bit more heavy than my grip bag. I also put it on and walked around and the straps on the Squatch uh, seem to be more comfortable. I'm not gonna say for sure until I've had, uh, you know, a couple tournaments in it, but, um, but overall so far, I'm actually shocked by how much uh, I like this bag. If you want any updates, um, yeah, I'm thinking about doing it in the bag, but this is my winter bag, so these aren't like the discs I always, always carry, but thinking about doing it in the bag, let me know if that's something you'd be interested in, and uh, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.